Preliminary step to installing the ZG-JSL linkage. Choose an actuator. Your choices are AFX series with 166 inch-pounds, AF series with 123 inch-pounds, NFX series with 87 inch-pounds, LF series with 33 inch-pounds, NMX series with 87 inch-pounds, and AMX series with 166 inch-pounds. There will be a slight torque reduction when using the ZG-JSL linkage. Verified jack shaft diameter. Linkage is preset for one inch shafts. The maximum diameter this linkage can accommodate is 1.05 inches. The linkage comes factory preset for one inch shafts and also includes a reversible metal insert for centering on half inch and three quarter inch shafts. Once the insert is turned to the desired shaft size, install the plastic insert holder. Position the anti-rotation plate for the actuator. Loosen the two metal screws and line up the two threaded holes on the base plate with the corresponding holes for the actuator. Holes are clearly marked by a numeric digit on the anti-rotation plate. Verify that the open-ended shaft of the linkage is in the correct position. Almost all dampers operated by jack shafts open when the jack shaft is turned in the counterclockwise or CCW direction. Ensure the shaft is turned completely clockwise or CW. For CW rotation, turn the shaft all the way CCW or to the right. Verify the position by the clamp itself or the small indicator below the shaft. Find a suitable location on the jack shaft to install the linkage. Either end of the jack shaft will work as long as it does not interfere with the bearing or operation of the damper. Place the open end of the linkage underneath the jack shaft. Slip the jack shaft into the open end until it meets the clamp. Holding the linkage in position, insert the supplied V-bolt from the other end. Hand tighten the nuts only to hold the clamp in position and prevent it from rotating. With the linkage in place, Secure it to the damper frame with the anti-rotation L-bracket. The bracket can rotate to any angle. Use the additional adapter plate for smaller bearings. Screw the adapter plate into the L-bracket as shown with the flathead screws. Install the L-bracket with or without the adapter plate to the shaft bearing bracket using the self-tapping screws. With the L-bracket attached, Slide the ZG-JSL linkage over until the tab on the bracket meets up with the slot on the linkage. Attach the actuator with the V-bolt and clamp. Align screw on the anti-rotation bracket with the slot on the actuator. Once the actuator is in place, tighten nuts evenly to prevent slippage. Ensure all the nuts are properly tightened and secured. The linkage and actuator are now installed on the damper shaft. Alternate installation. The linkage can also be configured to mount horizontally by repositioning anti-rotation plate 90 degrees.